what's going on everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is tay and welcome to tay budgets <laughs> In today's video we are not going to be doing a long video today because my previous videos were extremely long and I don't want to keep you guys too long I just want to get to the stuffing this is also a late stuffing this is my last pay of January if it is up in February please do not mind me I'm still trying to get a hang of all of this on top of having school and everything so without further ado let's get into the video and you guys always know that I am coming with a quote and today's quote will be sponsored by Pinterest again you know we love of Pinterest over here comment vibe working for the lifestyle I promised myself so this is a lifestyle I'm working for to budget more oh y'all like my um rubber band ring chat anyways to budget more to be disciplined to spend with caution and not just spend recklessly and also to develop a trust between me and money if that makes sense work for the life you want so my camera died I do not remember what I was saying but it's time to get cashed up and because we are not making a long video today I do not want to edit one hour for this let me take off this ring because it's distracting me this was my first time using my breakdown guys oh you guys haven't seen it yet so so I made this breakdown, tape budget breakdown, teller slip. I will be selling these soon. Um, I have not made an Etsy or whatever, but I will be selling those soon. And then I also use my cash money bag also, which I will be selling soon. I think my breakdown is here in my inspo binder. So let's go to that right now. Do, 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 do. How are you guys doing today? How how was your weekend? I literally just got from work and I said, yeah, I gotta film this. I am playing no games. Um, we are seeing all my stuff. Oh, here we go right here. So we don't want this video to be long like I was saying. So we're going to get right into stuffing. My breakdown here is on the side. I already counted. I have 710. I'll be stuffing 710 today. You know, y'all know me and my ones. So we're going to be very, very, very organized today. And by organized, I mean not all over the place like I was in my last video. Cause like I said, I'm new to this, but I also want to make sure that it is an organized video. So you guys will keep track and be on the same page as I am while doing my stuffing. <sighs> Surprisingly, I've been stuffing really good. Um, I've been literally trying to stuff as much as I can because I know that things are coming soon and I'm going to have to start um, purchasing some items. Some investment um, is coming up, I should say. And I need to get strict on my budgeting, not spending unconsciously. And what's the other word that I use? Impulsive spending. Yes, impulsive spending. And I'm doing this for me, honestly. Some people say oh what are you like i want to start this as a business but like i don't know what to tell people like i sell all things budgeting they're like what is that girl you 50 years ago and you don't know what budgeting is get it together can y'all believe i'm not counting this i'm just but i think i have 94 or 95 ones because yeah i went in the bank today and it was like hey i'm like hey Yep, I'm a well-known customer. I've been, I've become one of the budgeters that are friends with the bankers. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Can you believe the government made all this paper? This one feel extra fake. I hope it's not. Nobody got time for that. I ain't nobody got time for that. First things first that we're gonna do, we're gonna be very organized. We're going to move this to the side. I know it's a pretty presentation. I do not have any candles or anything on my desk today. I mean, we got a whole lot of lot of to go, but I will be unstuffing my wallet, my two beautiful wallets first we're going to start with my rfid wallet this is an rfid wallet if you guys don't know what an rfid wallet is it's an rfid wallet um and we're gonna take out all the coins i did do a coin stuffing but that didn't receive a lot of love so um i'm not going to be doing a coin stuffing again i would not be stuffing the coins on camera but i would do it off camera i mean coin stuffing you just putting the coins in the jar so it's not as interesting as cash stuffing so all that's left in my wallet i didn't really have cash in this wallet like i said before if you guys don't know this wallet is just for coins and my cards like that's the only reason why i carry this wallet around and if the cash cannot fit in this wallet i'll just put it in this wallet girl what are you doing with so many coins baby girl and i don't know how many this is but i did get coin from the bank and i will be just depositing that this is three dollar worth of coins so i would be depositing that into my blue wallet into the blue wallet you go nice nice and you're ready for the next two weeks 
On to the next wallet that is more stuffed, I should say. This wallet contains my cash envelope, my daily cash envelope, money, missing like, I don't even know, money, girl, receipts, all of that, and some more coins. So we're gonna take that out to ASMR, I think, LOL. Oh, we got a little more. Alrighty. Alright. We're just gonna put that to the side. I wish I had a little container to just swoop them in. But I don't. Um, then we have some cash here. Hello, cash. Let's see how much we have here. This is just cash just laying around. One, two. Oh, roll up cash. We love rolled up cash because we get so surprised when we see how much is rolled up. Well, I get surprised. I get excited. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, eighteen dollars. So y'all know. Okay, I am doing the one dollar so I can't say y'all know but if you have watched my previous videos y'all know that I'm doing the $1 challenge so all this will be going into my $1 challenge and then this $5 bill will be going into I don't know so we're gonna put that here oh matter of fact we're gonna put it here okay and we're going to put this behind the 50 and the $100 slot so I know that's for my $1 challenge I don't know if you guys can see that okay now you guys can see that Alrighty, next are, oh you guys have not seen, so I made these, oh this is the first time introducing to my channel, I have made these cash envelopes y'all, and these are my first cash envelopes, I bought myself a laminator, and I just did it all, I just did it all baby, I just did it all, okay, alright, so I'm going to be emptying my receipts, cause we gotta start over, I probably, all these, all these receipts are past the 30 day mark, I I think and I'm not returning I don't have anything else to return so I'm just putting the receipts over there the receipts are empty and you're going to be putting in these receipts because I did do a purchase recently so that's gonna go in here see look at receipts getting stuffed who, who you who you know who you know got receipts getting stuffed nobody all right next is offering we are going to be taking out of offering whatever we take out it's going this is going into the one dollar challenge I would roll it over into another envelope, but we want to build up on our, our $1 challenge. I just took $4 out of there, or 5 Whatever one it is, it got, it got $0 now. So, I'll do this after. I'm going to be stuffing the, um, I don't know yet. So, offering, da da da. Gas, I am not taking out of gas because gas is expensive. We can't take out of gas. Gas, gas has a lot of money in the envelopes, but we're not taking out of gas. Probably. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Food has nothing. Bang has nothing. Thing. Spending, this is a new one here. Spending. Spending is different from miscellaneous. So tell me why I spelt this wrong. In, in Jamaican or in Patois, it sounds like Padna. So that's how I spelt it. I spelt it how it sounds. Pardona. But when I realized and people told me, it's actually called partner. So I'm leaving it the Jamaican way and that's on that. I have nothing in miscellaneous. We spend that out and we have nothing in laundry. So the only one that has something right now is offering. No, I lied. Is gas. Should I take gas out? Mm -mm. Probably not. So we're gonna be stuffing that after off camera because we have to stuff the in the, the binder first. Where do I wanna put all of this? Let's put this in this here. Let's give me like just give me one second and then I'll be back. Don't miss me too much. And we're back on live. Alrighty. So I will not be stuffing all of my um envelope. What is this called? Envelope. I would not be stuffing all of my envelopes today. This is the first time you guys seen see this binder like this. The first time it was plain like Jane, but now it has like my you know pay budget on. There. I'll be changing it soon, but you know everything works with time and I also added the gold that's on my cash envelope I added that here because I want everything to be in unison so it can look a little bit more, you know classy Um, so everything will not be getting something today But as you guys know if you don't know I take out an extra Okay, so depending on the amount of the quantity that I have of envelope I will be taking out singles for that so each wallet will eventually be getting two dollars So I have about I think 40 say no I lied. 20 20 something 20 I think I have 24 envelopes so I don't know I think 20 24 envelopes so so before I used to have 22 envelopes so I take out 44 dollars so each envelope will be, get, get, be getting two dollars um I take out 48 dollars I think I think yeah 48 dollars so each of my envelopes will be able to get something at the end of the at the end of the video or the stuffing so no one will feel left out and I will have something in each envelope okay guys so no more talking um for First, phone bill slash bill is getting $20. I did pay my phone bill, so why did I take this out? Girl. This is not attached. It's just like, you know, to be cute. Um, I don't have a pen. 
Last time I did this on video, I said I wasn't gonna do this on video because it is very time consuming. Like writing in the uh writing in the deposit or withdrawal, but like guys, I'm moving by the way. That's why you hear me uh sound like this. I'll be using my pretty pen that I got from a dollar store. This is my happy mail. Um, you guys like my pen? So cute, right? All right, so bills. Oh, phone bill we'll be getting. What's today's date? The 28th. Oh, sorry, y'all. I'm hitting y'all and stuff. I'm trying to do this fast because I do not want to waste too much time it'll be getting twenty dollars and my bill every month is um 57 so it has a 20 so it has 22 and back in the binder you go i'm trying to do this as close as possible without bumping the camera too much next on the list is insurance car insurance car insurance is due this month is due the 28th oh my gosh it's due tomorrow so why do i keep taking this out my car insurance is 80 dollars. right now i have 74 in my envelope and it'll be getting ten dollars today so it got a ten all right two four six 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84. We have enough to pay our insurance. Yay. How much How much did I just say? Girl, do you really need to count that again? $84 in car insurance. Nice. Next is gas. I definitely, all everything in this binder is getting stuff, but the, the uh, sinking funds and the low priority binder won't be getting um, a lot of stuff. So gas, gas actually has a lot more than I expected it to have. Um, so gas today will be getting $20, $20 for gas. And it says it has $79. So let's check. Cause you know, sometimes my budget and sheet don't be adding up with cash in my hand. So this is 50, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 36, 77, 78, 79. Great. Add the 20. So now it has, girl, you can't count. It has $99. Yes, we want to definitely build gas up because gas is getting expensive and it's just too much. It's just honestly too much. We will not be stuffing uh, groceries. Wah, wah, wah. Uh, some of them don't have these, like the name, the label, because it just didn't come with it. That's why I can't wait to get my Cricut. Oh, so I can just make, make, make. So this is laundry because I did write it down. So I know I already know what it was, but it's good to also have it on the envelope laundry will be getting today fifteen dollars and i think that should be more than enough for me to do my laundry yes i have 37 dollars in laundry now how much is it getting 15 yes it's getting 15 so it's getting a 10 and it's getting a five so we should have 37 here. So we have 20, 25, 30. I'm sorry. 35, 36, 37. I thought I thought I counted wrong. It has 37. So because every time I go to the laundry, it's like I have to spend more than I bargain to spend. Like, all right, next is miscellaneous. Miscellaneous is getting $70. Because girl, I know this with miscellaneous. Miscellaneous be miscellaneous in me out and missing me with stuff because but we need to like February, we need to spend less in miscellaneous. That's my goal for february hopefully this video will be posted before february but being that we only have like four more days three to four more days i'm filming this on january 28th if you don't know now you know we have like three four more days in the in the month of january so i definitely want to be able to spend less on the miscellaneous envelope but for miscellaneous it'll be getting 70 dollars today so hopefully i don't get full 70 come on man please. so it has 82 dollars this is the most i've ever put in miscellaneous so what are you getting it's getting a 50 and it's getting a 20 I'm going to end up putting it in my wallet anyway, cash wallet, whatever. So it has 82, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 80, 81, 82. This video is definitely hopefully going by faster. I do not want to prolong this video because it is a struggle sitting through two hours of footage, one hour of footage. I'm just like, why? Because I talk too much. That's why. All right, so the black binder is done. This is my high priority binder slash daily binder. This is something that I use almost every day, every week, and every month. Next on the list is, this is my low priority which is like beauty, birthday, Christmas, clothing, fun, give nails, personal, and I added a new one. It's not coming for right now, but I see some people struggle. Wedding, it's not coming right now, but I want a glamorous wedding. The so glamorous wedding means glamorous saving. Oh, and this is technology. Technology isn't getting anything. So birthday is going to be getting $10 today. I'm still trying to figure out what is this envelope for? I know it's for my birthday, but 
what is this envelope for? Like on clothes, like I don't want any clothes for my birthday, but like the clothes that I'm gonna be wearing, hopefully we can get a good amount of money in here before my birthday. Birthday has $60 now. It'll be getting a 10, so 20, 30, 40. 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Um, Christmas, nope. Clothes, nope. nope. Purse, fun, nope. Get, nope. Nail, nope. Personal, woo, woo. Personal will be getting 25. I did use the money that was in there because I took care of myself today. I treated myself today, so I took that personally so today i will be depositing 25 dollars into my personal and that will be getting a 20 and a 5. thank you personal for being there let me tell you guys this has helped me out so much with like saving and having these envelopes because like imagine if i was just using my card like i i, I would be like digging for money you know like okay tech isn't getting anything and wedding isn't getting anything close this up and then because i don't know why i put that binder first but this is my high priority binder that we will be stuffing next by the way it will not be getting everything will not be getting stuff i said high priority i meant uh cat uh what do you call it thing sinking funds this is my sinking funds binder uh car maintenance will not be getting anything debt will be getting something though because that never goes away 20 and a five i want to start my um debt payoff journey soon hopefully i have not checked with my loan company student loans if anything has been forgiven probably i should make that a point of duty to do that because i need to know you know what i'm paying back yeah debt will be getting 25 if i failed to mention that so oh we got the need you're gonna have to use a calculator 74 so debt has 74 dollars now which is pretty good i wish i had more but you know it's a process it's time it takes time we won't rush the process and this could be like not just student loans but like credit card debt any debt that i have really but i was just focusing this envelope to more student loans deposit it no emergency yes we always have to stuff emergency always because that's important emergency has 65 and today it will be getting 25 dollars i think i think i did my rap math i think i did my math correctly 65 plus 25 is 90 so now my emergency fund has 90 dollars um so it's getting a five and a 20 can you ah, look at this in this video my bills are organized two four sixty 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. In my previous video, my previous cash stuffing, I should say, it was not very organized. It was not organized and my bills were all over the place, but everything is working out slowly but surely. Next is savings. We always want to be stuffing our savings and emergency fund because you never know. So right now, savings have has $96 and today savings will be getting, okay, Okay, so I mixed it up. Emergency was supposed to get 20 while savings gets 25. But hold on, look at this bill. What is this? Child, anyways. So that's fine. You know, I'll just put a 20 in savings. I mean, it still has something anyway. So it has $116 in savings. That's great. 246, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. It has 116 now. Let me just go back and double check and make sure that emergency got 25 and I'm not just bugging out. I mixed it up. It's okay though. Vision, which is business. I use this for something that will be coming very soon. My family needs to grow more before I tell you guys what's going on. My budgeting family, I should say. I want to grow it more before I introduce what I want to introduce to you guys. So vision, I spent vision and I wrote it. I should have, oh yes, I wrote it down and I took everything from it. It was only 30, um, $31 that I took. So I'm depositing back, not a lot, but vision is getting $10. Our one dollar challenge will be getting all these ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. I thought it was eighteen. Oh, it's seventeen. But my one dollar challenge, I do not know how many ones I have. 
I'll be counting it at the end of the year, December 31st, or my last cash, my last cash stuffing, I will be counting. I need to have a safe so I can just deposit this into the safe and then just keep going. I refuse to count this. I just count it when I'm putting it in, but I don't know how much because I don't keep track. All right, next is car. I really hope for the best with this envelope because girl, that's all I'm gonna say. Um, car will be getting $10 today. Fortunately, unfortunately, I wish I can stuff more, but I'm stuffing what I can. But by the end of the night, car will have over a hundred dollars. So I'm not worried because I'm going to be stuffing the $2 into each envelope. So it has 99. Did I take out the $10 yet? Hold up. 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89. And it's getting a $10 bill. So that is it for the last binder of today. And I have a lot of money in front of me. You guys might be thinking, oh my gosh, you still got money in front of you, girl you're not done well i actually am done with my cash stuffing i will be doing a separate video on my challenges so if you guys want to see that make sure you guys oh see i made it all pretty for you period if you guys want to see my cash stuffing video this video will be up this video that i'm filming will be up and then afterwards will be my cash my challenges savings challenges stuffing video so if you guys are interested in that make sure you guys like this video subscribe turn on your post notification and drop in the comments down below this is not budget related but drop in the comment section down below what is your favorite ice cream i just want to see if you guys got to this part in this video i really want to know because i I'm, I'm feeling for i'm actually feeling for some ice cream right now like i could really do for some ice cream right now my favorite ice cream is vanilla bean i love love i can die for vanilla bean right now and i also love rum and raisin but take out the raisins i'll just eat eat the ice cream and the rum no prob but anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching this video if you made it to this point that means you made it to the end but not to the end of the channel but just to the end of the video and i'll see you guys in the next video bye